Hey everybody, welcome back to Tomcat Air Guns. Today, Halloween, boogaloo, <laughs> I've decided to shoot my Extreme Bench Rest 75 yard card for the lockdown in 9.5 edition. <laughs> the sun is getting low, it's right about in my eyes right now. Uh, so I've got only about probably an hour to shoot. So I'm gonna do my 75 today, and maybe my 100 uh, tomorrow. I wanted to show you guys the equipment I'm using. I've got, of course, my Red Wolf Midnight Edition. Um, most accurate gun in my collection by far. It's got the 580cc bottle. You guys know me, of course I'm shooting off an AccuTac FCG2 bipod. Uh, I've got the Hawk Frontier First Focal Plane. Uh, I believe this is actually a discontinued model uh, due to the reticle. Uh, and sandbag in the back. And then I use my tech mat over here, uh, just bony elbow, you know, it just gets uncomfortable for a while. So, uh, oh, and the DOA shooting bench. Um, I wanted to show you guys this. I'm going to be doing a review on this here pretty soon. Uh, I brought this down to Texas with me when I saw Michael Went of Airgun Nation and Chuck Meisenheimer and John Tafoya, and we had a great time. And I wanted those guys to try this out down there. And I'll tell you what, what they all kind of gravitated towards it. I also had the Caldwell down there as well, the guys, the one that you guys probably know of, the, um, the stable table. But uh, this one, it sits a little taller. It's actually more stable and uh, more comfortable, and it has more room, so kind of more of everything. Anyway, I'm going to go over that in another video. Let's get to shooting my 75-yard card, and uh, let me show you guys where it is. My card is all the way down there, tucked in the trees. So I'm about ready to shoot. Um, I just got to air up my gun. Oh, speaking of airing up my gun, I just picked up a brand-new Omega Patriot <laughs> Omega Patriot cylinder and uh, I've owned a lot of different cylinders a lot of different valve systems and I'm really digging this one this is a vast improvement over previous models I am loving it a lot <laughs> so I'll talk to you about that in another video as well so let's get to shooting <music> Okay, I just got done shooting my 75 yard card. Let's go down and take a look. I haven't seen it yet other than shooting it through the scope. Um, had a couple where I pulled it, but uh, I don't think I got anything outside the eight ring. We'll see, let's go down. All right guys, I just got down range and haven't really taken a look at this yet, but uh, here, EBR entry. Uh, let's take a look at what we got here. I didn't use many ciders. I did forget to shoot my pellet challenge. That's all right. I'm just going to go up and shoot that again because I'll tell you guys what, I shot this whole card in, I'd say, somewhere between five and ten minutes. I wouldn't be surprised if it was about seven minutes or so uh, from first shot to, you know, all the way done. So, see what we got here. I did shoot from the bottom up. So, a couple ciders and we got a, I think that's going to be a nine. That one, oh, that's really close, right on the line. That's either a nine or a bull. Uh, this one's gonna be a nine, that one's gonna be a nine. That one's close, that's gonna be a nine. Uh, eight, that's a 10. Uh, and I guess my first bull. Uh, that one's super close. I'm gonna call that a nine. That's a bull, that's a bull, that's a nine, that's a eight, that's a nine, nine, that's a bull. Nine, bull, bull. We got a nine, this one I pulled, <laughs> and that one I pulled. <laughs> uh, bull, bull, nine, nine, uh, bull, nine, and nine. 
not bad, not bad at all. I mean, I'm not counting this as I'm going, but I got a lot of bullseyes or tens, however you want to look at it, and a lot of nines. So I'm going to say somewhere around that 225, maybe I hit 230 on this at 75 yards. Light, super, super light winds. Um, so it's no surprise, you know, I did decent, but I did shoot it a little bit too fast. I should have taken my time a little bit. Uh, but I know that when that sun goes down, uh, that's it's game over. That's when the wind starts picking up, inversion starts happening. So I had to kind of rush a little bit. So, All right, guys, I just got done scoring my card and um, came out with a really good score. Uh, but this one right here, this nine crossed out to a 10. At first, I scored it a nine. And then as I was looking through, I remembered about looking at the pellet stain. I think it was this one or whatever. And this has just a hint of pellet stain in this red tent. <laughs> so I changed my nine and gave myself a 10. If you guys disagree, put it down below in the comments. It's okay. Um, it's really, really close. I mean, and I also thought about this. Usually um, at Extreme Bench Rest, they upsize to 30 cal. That would definitely be a 10 if it was upsized. Even the 25 cal, an easy 10. So without further ado, how much did I get? I got a 234 with six bullseyes. <laughs> Probably one of my best cards yet, but hey, no surprise. There's almost no wind today. So <laughs> that's all I got for you today. Um, happy Halloween. Wish me luck tomorrow on my 100 yard card.